Hey guys and welcome to my channel and today we are at Gokul. This is known as the Kunjigali. We have just entered one of the gates, one of the seven gates. We have a guide with us. Let's see what he what stories he is going to say. Look at this. These are the ancient roads where Bal Krishna used to do mischief. Makhan Chor, as he is called. Yes, you can see a Gaushala. All the roads are now tiled. Previously, they were made of cow dung. Ashwik is feeling cold. Ashwik, did you like Gokul? Let's see all these roads from where Sri Krishna used to roam around. Oh, that man almost crashed there. Nice. So now we are reaching the Sri Baldev Dwar and pedas, lots of pedas. Radhe Radhe. Ashpik is already like the temple. All of you write Radhe Radhe in the comments. Look at the stories of Lord Shri Krishna. And we have reached Sri Jai Gopal Lal Mandir. Jai. And this is where the scam starts. They don't allow mobile phones inside from this point onwards. Uh, the guide then takes you inside and tells you various stories about Bal Krishna. Uh, all is fine to this point. Uh, we are made to sit in batches of about 15 to 20 people. And we have to keep chanting and sliding slowly while sitting and chanting continuously. One is not allowed to stand. Uh, the guide will tell you about four different bhogs or donations, uh, but will not tell you the cost at that particular moment. Then once you reach the front with uh, other people around 20 or so, the guide will uh, say that now you listen to the main priest and I'll meet you outside and then he will leave. Uh, then the main priest will start telling stories and then uh, he will mention about those books uh, or donations which start somewhere around some 5,000 and then 12,000, 28,000, 57,000 uh, and so on and some even goes in lakhs. And they will make people raise hands and then they will give you this uh, piece of red cloth uh, that's, that is like a, once you raise your hand that is like a marker that we are going to pay so that once you leave that particular area they will catch hold of you uh, that that means you have accepted to donate and then they will always say that today is an auspicious day and hence you have the golden cradle for Bal Krishna uh, they will let you swing it and before leaving the string which you are kind of pulling to swing the cradle they will say that you you are supposed to commit for the donation and they will Literally, they are very good at words. They will many gullible people will fall, and they will raise their hands, and then they will have to pay some somewhere around five thousand minimum uh, is I think so one thousand. But even when you say that, that then they get very annoyed. The priest uh, become very rude. Uh, I uh, vetoed. We denied to pay anything, and then the priest, the main priest, got very angry and very rude, and he started to talk in a very different tone to us. And then they even say something like, "Jo kukul me aake hasta hai, uska ghar basta hai, aur jo rota hai, wo wapis ja kar sab khota hai." 
so they try to kind of play on your minds uh, uh, it, it wasn't a good experience for us left a very bitter test uh, we did come with a good kind of you know faith in here and then after, while leaving even though we did not pay we felt a bit let down not by the place but of course the priest uh, there and possibly even the guide the guide had told us that uh we can pay whatever we want and we gave him some 100 bucks but overall it wasn't that great an experience the place is obviously divine no doubt about that but the uh, uh kind of racket they are having uh, does leave a bad taste you have a small uh temple once you come outside the nanmal then you have a small uh, temple on the left side as well and there again the priest will ask for some 200 500 rupees for just touching uh, that uh, particular idol so it has become a bit commercial so it's a kind of spam, scam and i have checked uh, many other portals once i was back i checked many other i just did a google search and i could find many such stories many of them have openly talked about the same same modus operandi there are even other youtube videos and they, the priest even the priest which you meet outside they almost have the same stories to tell and the st- same particular style and obviously the main priest is very very rude uh, if you don't pay and uh, do uh, do visit gokul not that you should not but best uh, way would be to explore on your own by doing a research on your own not to go for the guide and not get swayed by the priest obviously one can donate with free will but that should be a free will completely what they, we see there it's more of a forcing and making you pay uh, and making you feel guilty about not paying and the payment also goes to personal accounts and not to a official government portal or something like that so uh, that's that is something to look out for thankfully we did not pay anything uh do like and share this video uh do comment and subscribe to my channel i'll be posting much more on mathura gokul and vrindavan and later agra and jaipur thank you so much